and welcome to the Cubed Core. My name is Colin, and welcome back to Diablo 3 Episode 8. Now, if I remember correctly, we're supposed to go fight the Skeleton King, but I don't quite remember how to get to him. I remember we're supposed to go down to that spot, but I, like I said, I don't quite remember how to get to him, so I need to talk to this guy again. Oh, what's this? I thought it was his diary. No, it was his... What the what? I have the crown. Where is the skeleton? Here we go, king? okay. Ah, at last. With it, you can unlock the sealed door in the room where you rescued me and entered the Oh, right, the right, 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 right. Gotcha, 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 gotcha. Okay. I Who are you? I am the last of the Herodrim. I couldn't always claim this. In fact, if I had turned to the Herodric teachings sooner, Diablo could have been stopped before his reign of terror began. What is you a this. When the first signs appeared, I did nothing. I had shrugged the old tales off like they were so much fantasy. And Tristram, no, the world has paid dearly for my arrogance. Why his I alone? I have tried to make up for my failings. Leah and I have spent her lifetime scouring the world, collecting pieces of the prophecy of the end days. If I can decipher it, we will have the key to defeating the Lords of Hell. Okay, then. Your adopted you niece? You draw great strength from your love for Leah. I do not know what my life would have been like had I not raised her. Oh, it must have been difficult for Leah, following an old man on a mad search for the secrets to defeating the Lords of the Burning Hells. Probably sounds crazy. <laughs> but though she has seen her share of mysterious things, she is still unsure of my quest. I, I can understand. She has no never kidding. seen anything like Diablo and his brothers. Neither have I. The prophecy of the end days is contained within the Herodric tomes I inherited from my ancestor, Jared Kane. Why not just go explore them? It is them? a warning to those who could interpret it regarding Hell's ultimate invasion of our world. Written by many different people throughout history, in many different lands. So... All known versions of the prophecy are incomplete. I have spent a good part of the past 20 years trying to complete it. I am certain it holds the answers to defeating the Lords of Hell. So it's not just in that one spot, it's spread around. In multiple different languages. Okay. Or maybe in one and they all have to learn that one language? Dang, that'd be hard on their end. Diablo caused Leoric's madness? Leoric resisted Diablo's attempts to possess him, but the effort left him weak and confused. When his son Albrecht was kidnapped to be a vessel for Diablo, it destroyed any sanity Leoric had left. What did okay. Leoric do after he became the Skeleton King? He commanded an army of the dead deep within the cathedral, finally serving the Lord of Terror he had resisted while alive. Wah, wah. Many adventurers tried and failed to slay the Skeleton King. Shway. It was left to Leoric's eldest son, Aiden, to finally kill the monster his father had become. I'm sorry, Shlay? Not slay, Shlay? Okay. Let's go slay a beast. What? What do you know of the girl Leah? And Not her too much, I'm afraid. They came here almost a year ago. She split it back uh, in his days in the old cathedral, looking for old tax. Yeah, I don't care. Need to get to the thing. The yep, need to get to the cathedral miles. garden. Okay. Now back on track. Cathedral garden. Here we go. Now back on track. Oh, my bad. I say that a lot. <laughs> my bad. My bad. My bad. So this stays the same, but the other thing doesn't. Okay. Sorry, I'm kind of moving my microphone a bit. <sighs> but, ooh, I can break ashes. But they aren't ashes, they're... urns of ashes. It lied to me. The game lied to me, guys. It freaking lied to me. Hey, cathedral level two. Oh, good. Freaking hopefully I can do this fast enough. 
If not, I'll have to do it in the next episode too. Freaking, which means I have to restart it. Whoops! Ha! Death kill, motherfuckers. All right, let's do this fast. Whoa, dang, you hurt. Oh, right, wrong button. I have a freaking, I forgot. Oh, well. Yeah! Dang, that's a lot more powerful now that it has that, like, flame circle effect. Anything down here? Nope. Okay, moving on. Gotta go fast. What the f- I thought I killed all these guys. Well, he's done. <laughs> oh, hello. You're dead. Oh my god. This is gonna be an epic battle of epic proportions. Holy moly. I don't have enough spirit. That's in! That's in! That's mine! Yeah! yeah! Here we go! Whoops! I will My not bad. do that. Dang! 39 kills all at once! Oh! He's going down! You're done, son! They're both done, son! Get wrecked! Come back here, you wuss! Don't run from me! Don't run from me! Loser! Like I said, a battle of epic proportions! And it was epic. That was actually pretty freaking fun. When we return from our horrific defeat in Westmarch, my beloved king lost all pretense of sanity. He seethed with rage, spitting curses upon us as traitors. With great sorrow, I ran him through. Oh. Oh, he, this is the guy who killed the king. Oh. What the? Oh, whoops, my bad. I forgot the buttons, guys. I forgot the buttons. Oh, hey, buddy. Hey, I got Dang, there's like nothing. Alright. Well, that actually took a darn long while. Hello. You're done. Flying crossbow. Woo! Here we go, back into the thick of it. Battle away! Oh, I should have freaking used the wall. Eh, it's okay. Whatever. Oh, hey guys, what's up? Bring it on, motherfuckers! Come back here, you little son of a gun. What's this? Short staff. I will oh, not hey. accept this. It's not my time to die. What? Enraged spirit? <laughs> he can't be enraged if he's dead. <laughs> Actually. That was absolutely retarded of me to say. If he's an enraged spirit, then he's already dead. So did I just kill an enraged if I just killed something that's already dead, what happens to it? Does it come back to life or does it die permanently and can't come back ever? What the heck have I done? Oh, adventuring leather cuffs of the hawk. Loot! <laughs> Loot. That's a big room. I'm gonna explore that in just a moment. Just wanna see what's this way. 
so let's see what this way is. Open a door, there's some enemies. Kick their butts, because I'm a boss. Yeah! Come back here, you little dirtbag. Nothing runs from me. And if they do run from me, I'll catch them. Hey guys, how's it going? Boom, shakalaka! You all about to die. Get out of my way. Uh, yeah, you done, son. Boom! You're done. We're done. He's done. If it is a he. Oh no. I don't know if it's a he. I mean, she is the presumed, like, when talking grammatically correct, if you don't know the sex of something, you call it an it or a he. Unfortunately, I mean, that's just the way it works. But, thinking about it, how do you know if a skeleton is a he or a she? I mean, if they can talk, let's assume they can talk, okay? You wouldn't be able to tell the difference be because the voice box would be gone, so there would just be no difference in voice. Unless it's some sort of other weird magical thing. Oh, hey, it's an exit. Um, what else was it, though? Ah, oh, shoot, hang on, I had it. Um, also, the figure would be completely gone. You can say, oh, well, ladies' bones are different. Yeah, well, all human bones are different. They all are slightly shaped differently because we all are different shapes and sizes. There's no preset for men and women. So, no matter what, you're going to have differences. How are you supposed to know, like, which sex they are? And why are all the skeletons in here the same size? Why are there no children skeletons ever? Like, I've never seen an enemy child skeleton, which would actually be pretty sweet if you ask me. I mean, they'd change it up. But no. Oh my gosh, these things are freaking beast mode. They have crap ton of HP. And what is this stuff they're shooting at me? Like, what? I think it's poison, I'm not sure. Gosh, though, they have so much HP. Oh, yeah, double damage. There we go. That's good. My strides grow longer. Whoa, level it. level 11. I leveled up. Sweet. Come here, you dirtbag. Rippling wave. Okay, whatever that does. Northern breeze. Whatever that does. Strength. I will forever live in anguish for my last attempt to honor my king. As we lay him to rest in his burial chamber, he manifested as a hideous skeletal demon. Gorash and my other knights were overcome at once, but I fought on. Oh, okay. So, I got a new skill. Let's check it out. Oh! Crippling Wave. Whoa! Oops, my bad. In comparison to Fists of Thunder. Oh, what's the, what's the difference? Teleport your tar uh, teleport to your target and attack it with a series of rapid punches, or sweeping punches that cripple enemies, reducing their attack and movement speed. Ooh, I'll have to think about that. For now, I'll stick with this one. Um. Shoot. Is there, is, I hope there's a thing here that I can like come back to. I really don't want to have to go through Cathedral level 2 again. That was the thing. Maintain your be. incantations. He will soon turn. What the? Dude, come on. There's got to be a thing. There's, there's got to be a thing, right? There's a thing, right? freaking great well if you like the video hit like if you want to see more from me hit the subscribe button if you want to help me out hit the share button and tell your friends my social media will be in the description and i'll see you in the next video